Thanks for calling. Can't come to the phone right now. If you leave your name and number, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks for calling. Bye. Hi, Jennifer. Uh, this is Dwight. I'm calling from Malware Bytes. I understand that you were having a little bit of an issue, and I was tasked with calling you and trying to uh, trying to see what I hello. Could do. Oh, hello. Is this Jennifer? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I couldn't get to the phone in time, and uh, the machine's picked up on your recording. So don't say anything you don't want me to know. Oh, no problem. No problem. <laughs> no. Actually, would you mind calling me back so you're not keep recording this thing? Sure, just get, I'll call you back in uh, about two minutes. Thank you, I appreciate it. Thank you. Bye. Okay, believe it or not, hang on a second. Sure. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, oh, no let's problem. start over again. <laughs> All right, I, I, I'd gotten a, uh, a request for a contact... Uh, unfortunately, they didn't put in here quite what uh, you were uh, needing help with, uh, so I guess I'll just need a little bit of information about what we're trying to work through here. Okay. Uh, let me try to make this as short and simple as I can. Um, actually, I, <laughs> uh, I I goofed up. Um, I had uh, my renewal coming up for um, my annual premium. Right. And I have it uh, obviously on a uh, credit card, and I'm getting ready to get rid of that card. And I was asking a question as to whether or not I could get, you know, I've got no. Uh, that's on the only direct pay that I have in my entire life, and I don't like to do direct payments. Is there any way to get a paper statement once a year? Okay, so instead of uh, instead of the green payment option, you would like. Uh, you would like to have actually a paper statement sent. To yeah, you? yeah. Well, I'd write a check and blah blah blah, and we, you know, we've been doing this for years. So, okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Um, I can switch that over for you. Uh, actually, right here. Give me just a second. Oh wow. Uh, let's see here, there. All right, this is a paper statement, and let's see. And that is going to. Um, the address beginning with 20863, is that correct? Right, right, uh-huh. All right, to make sure. Well, it's funny you mentioned that because I tried to go in there and I disabled the, you know, thing, but it didn't give me an option to do to do anything else, you know, so I didn't want to do that either. Right. I didn't want it to end. So you've done me a big favor, and that was all I really wanted to get done. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm just, I'm finalizing it right here. Um, wow. Let's see here. And, um... So you're getting ready to get rid of that card. So what, did you want me to delete that card ending in five six? Yeah, six? yeah. Go ahead and delete because it won't. After this point, it won't work anymore anyway. Because I was oh. uh, actually going to the bank on Wednesday, uh, Wednesday right. and to make a deposit, and I was going to cancel that while I was in there. So all right, let me go ahead. I'm going to delete that out of the system. So we've gotten that out. Um, yeah, that that's finalized. Was there anything else that I could uh, that I could help you out with then? Well, see, that was that's my, that was part of my issue. So anyway, I went. I'm not tech savvy to begin with, right? But I went into my account, and was trying to do this and this and this and this, and then I thought, okay, well, I'll just call you and contact you. But then right. I came across three eight hundred numbers, and one was a four zero eight number, and this, yeah, you know, I went like, holy cow, which number did I call? And then I went contact us thing, and it gave me oh contact us. So I started writing my you know description into that that uh file mm -hmm. and turned out it was pissed off customer or whatever something yeah 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 and it went to them and, I, was, and there, I got an email back saying i don't think you intended this for to be on our site and and i'll refer you and transfer you over to something and that person to do it in with it i can i can give you our 800 number if that helps if you have any future well, okay. Let me let me get a piece of a pen here. Um, right. But anyway, so you see, when I was spending so much time trying to get this thing straightened out, I thought this shouldn't be this hard. And then I, you know, there wasn't any. Just I just had a mess with it. And then um, I just was having a, an issue, and I wrote a response back saying, you know, I, I just don't appreciate the fact that I can't talk to somebody like you. I mean, you're right. you're awesome. You're terrific. 
Thank you. But look what I had to go through to get to that person or get to you. Right. Yeah, it is a little bit of a hassle. And then they also, they revamp the website quite often. And uh, uh, so then, you know, you think you know where something is, and all of a sudden it's changed. It's in (laughs) another space. Yeah, don't do that. It's just a big big headache. Yeah. Well, anyway, so that was my uh, my response uh, Uh was that I was just upset. Because I love you guys, and I think you all have a good product, and and, it, and I've had it for years. So, you. We're, we're you know, that's, that was never the problem or the issue. It was just the fact that I never could reach somebody to actually mm-hmm. talk to like I am with you. In fact, of November of uh, last year, not this last year, 18, uh, my malware just started doing all crazy things, and I couldn't get, fix it, and I couldn't fix it, and couldn't fix it. And so I sent in a request then, and... Somebody did call me, and she said, oh, well, you need to download this toolkit or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And I said, I don't allow anybody on my computer. I said, you know, you can explain it to me, and I'll walk me through it, and I'll be able to. And they refused to do it. And so I went like a month and a half, almost two months with that, without it working properly. I see. And I got upset and called back, and I said, well, at least you should give me like two months credit. And that, mm-hmm. that was not that didn't go. Right. So then what I did is I just uninstalled it and reinstalled the whole thing over again and blah, blah, blah. So anyway, I just tried to explain that my experience with trying to speak with someone directly from your company at this point two years ago and now now has not been uh, an easy process. So Yeah, I saw uh, saw a file in here, uh, yeah, about, about, uh, let's see, uh, it was support ticket starting 273. Yeah, I, I see that uh, that problem that you had the last time as well. Yeah. Um, Anywho, uh, I, I don't want to wear you out, and I appreciate you. Uh, the, the number, the direct number, this one should get you a person every time. Uh, okay. We're, we're here 24-7. It is, uh, I figured that, right, right. It's 800-520-5444. Okay. 2796 Two seven nine six. Let me repeat that. Eight hundred five two zero two seven nine six. Correct. Great. Okay, I'll put that in my file here. So um, that's very helpful, and I appreciate and that. And I, like I'm I said, gonna, uh, I'm just going to repeat just just for the re- recording for my boss what we did today. Uh, we okay. changed you over from the green billing from the electronic statement to a paper statement, which will be mailed right. to your uh, registered regi- uh, residence that we right. have here on file. Um, and we also deleted the uh, the form of payment uh, right. ending in five six six six, and it'll be going. Pay- we're going to be receiving a paper check, and uh, I've went ahead and accessed all all that through the uh, expedited help process. Okay. And your account will be billed sixty nine ninety five for the help. I'm sorry. Uh, the the charge sixty nine ninety five for the accelerated help. No, I'm not paying. I mean, what do you mean? Well, when uh, when we have to contact, instead of you contacting us and we have to contact you. Did you inform uh, me that before we started this conversation? Well, it, w- it was uh, on the recording on your machine when I started speaking. And I oh well, I see. I didn't. I didn't see. I didn't hear the part of the recording because yeah. it was recording on the machine. And yeah. Uh, no, no way, no way. Oh, it's already been processed. Don't worry about it. You don't have to do anything else. We we processed it on five six 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 before we uh, before we disconnected or we deleted that uh, form of payment. Well, th- I won't be paying that. Well, it's already been paid. I mean, it's already. Well, been I'll it's already I'll been I'll, uh, I'll dispute it. Well, we, we can't have you doing that, ma'am. Cause we'll, we'll we'll send a recording of this call to the bank to show that it's a valid charge. Yeah. Okay. And it'll also have that recording that say, "Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't, you're, I didn't get to the phone fast enough, and I wasn't." Present during the first part of the conversation. Yeah, that 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 part of the file will be will be sent to both both ones both of them. And and if you're, I mean, really, if you're going to tell us you're going to dispute a, a legit charge, ma'am, I will put a 1999 stupid bitch fee on here. Boy, I'm sorry I ever started this process. Okay, what well, are, are we are we just gonna are we just gonna go ahead with the 69.95? Or do I have no. to throw a 1999 stupid bitch fee on here as well? Uh, I don't know what that means, and I don't know what that is. Okay. 
Well, the 1999 stupid bitch fee is for people that deny our services, say we didn't do a good enough job, so you don't want to pay the bills. It's for it's for hobos and, and uh, deadbeats, and and, uh, and we could tack that down. It's almost like an interest payment, but it's it's a stupid bitch fee. Okay, so I'll dispute that one too. So okay, you're going to dispute the stupid bitch fee. I'm just explaining to you that had I heard the front end of our con- the conversation when you first called and you said, uh-huh. "Oh, I am whoever," I don't even see. I didn't even hear your name. Yeah, uh, it's, it's, I'm it's calling and the back. I'm returning your call. The, this call is going to cost you sixty nine ninety nine or whatever. I would have yeah. hung up. But you didn't, and, and, and by doing. But that, I didn't you, hear you it. it. You, you see consented. my point? I didn't have a benefit of hearing it. When you picked up the phone, you were a consenting adult, and you actually asked me to call you back. That's double consent. But I didn't. I asked you to call me back because we were still being recorded, and I didn't want a, a thirty-minute conversation on my recording machine. Well, maybe we should have had the conversation on your recording machine, and you could have turned up your hearing aids and re-listened to it. Well, okay. Now, see, I just said I, I appreciated your company. I thought it was a good product and this and that. I'm yeah. calling to complain about your accessibility of being able for someone to be able to talk to you, but now you're telling me in order for someone to talk to you, customer service, hello, you're telling me I get charged for it. Okay, yeah, so call, that makes no sense. Call you. If you called me, if you called us, it, would, it wouldn't have cost anything. But when I did not dialogue, know that. It's very expensive because we have to route through India and then back to the United States. Very expensive. They have monkeys that run the telephone lines over there. They string them along the trees. Well, I, I have never, you know, I've had some companies that I have. now. What you have now. Well, I'm sorry, sir, but um, on, on the record, I did not hear the introduction to this conversation. It's, or not, it's, or not, it's not on the record. I turned the recording off. It's not on the record anymore. I'm going to turn it back on now, though. It's on again now. Well, it doesn't matter. I'm I'm it's on, done. It's on now. We didn't get that part where you said that. Well, I just said, for the record, I Turn did not Turn hear the front end of that conversation to to imply or to my, give me knowledge of the fact that if I continue to speak with you, I would be charged I turned it, anything. I turned it off again. Why do you keep trying to get that on the record? Stop that. I'm going to turn it back on now. I'm trying to get that on the record. I'm going to say it one more time. No, I'm turning it off. Okay, then we're done. Thank you, sir. I appreciate you. Have a good night.